This is Peter Arinder. I'm Chief Investment Officer with Fortress Fund Managers. It's been another interesting week in financial markets. Um, something that was being anticipated, a bit of uh, fear and trembling, was the latest meeting and announcement from the U.S. Federal Reserve, the Fed, uh, which came on, on Wednesday, wondering whether the uh, extraordinary amount of stimulus they've been providing to financial markets would continue in light of the fact there's been an economic recovery uh, over the last several months. The short answer to that is yes, they've recommitted to keeping rates extremely low, to continuing to buy securities in the secondary market. So their, their stimulus is still in place, even as uh, more fiscal stimulus comes from the from the U.S. government. In terms of the toing and froing in financial markets, it's been another week where the real stocks are winning, while the some of the higher priced technology stocks have uh, continued to ease. Those stocks that we own around the world, um, U.S. financials like Ameriprise, Morgan Stanley, uh, healthcare companies like United Health, and even some of the the larger, um, boring uh, Japanese industrial companies have had very very strong performance this week as well. So. Real companies with real earnings, uh, good valuations continue to perform well, which is gratifying because we have portfolios full of those things. Um, closer to home, one of our positions in Trinidad, uh, Guardian Holdings, has uh, reported some reasonably good earnings. And the stocks had a nice week also additionally on their announced intention to cross-list in, in Jamaica, on the Jamaica Stock Exchange, which tends to result in a bit of a higher price in, in Trinidad as well. 